How's it going boys and 3.5% Today I got food poisoning and it is absolutely not fun at all Farts currently cannot be trusted to be just farts if you know what I'm saying But more about that and CERN and the eclipse later on Considering today I have absolutely no energy, movement is painful, slow, and my brain feels like it's fried, we are gonna be playing something that fits us perfectly. Now admittedly this probably fits us perfectly in default situations and scenarios also, but you know, that's a different story. We're gonna be playing Selesnia Historic Life Gain, and I don't remember that I say today on standard or whatever, doesn't matter. Anyway, this is historic. We have uh, the Moon Dancer, we have Collect the Company, we have Protection. It is as beautiful as you would expect from Life Gain, expecting great things. Two Nick Shrines, 20 aliens to be specific, 2.3 average mana cost, and with that being said, without any further ado, let's just get a crack in and see what happens. Good opening hand, we have quite the potential here. Now the question is, do we want to go for the Moon Dancer or Voice of the Blessed here? Not sure, but I definitely will instantaneously go for the White Land. And it's gonna be great. Oh, I forgot to switch the scene. Oh yeah. Well, again, I, I am. I feel extre- <laughs> I feel okay, boys. I, I feel just extremely tired. But you know what's great? After I vomited in the night because I had no idea I have food poisoning only until the moment in night because I ate the thing that I got it from around 12 a.m. or something like that. It, it, it was a long one, okay? And man, then I woke up in the middle of night and, you know, I'm a giga chad and shit. So I was like, ah, oh, my, my, my stomach's a little bit achy-wakey and whatnot. So I was like, that's not a problem at all. I can I can survive this, it's fine. So go back to sleep. And at one point, I'm like, oh man, oh man, is this gonna be good? Because I can feel water gathering in my mouth. And by the way, I don't know if this is a common thing or not, but when you're about to vomit, do you also have the situation where water starts rushing into your mouth? Well, not rushing per se, but you, you kind of get the point, right? Anyway, that's a Silax. I don't like that because... Wait, can I just... No, I can't win. Well, ain't that horrible. Wait, or could I win? No, 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 I could not have one. Well, it ain't life horrible, boys. Well, whatever. Let's see him poc uh, proc the Silax. Why is he playing Silax? Look at that. Into the North. Remember when this card came out? Was good. Was good. And by the way, today, two. Oh wow, he's saving one mana. What a giga chat. Oh, that's big. That's actually kind of big. I need that collective company, boys. It's gonna be amazing. Anyway, boys. Also, also, also. Let, let, let. Today is the day when this video comes up. Hopefully, I'm gonna be feeling much better tomorrow. And it's the eclipse o'clock. And it's gonna be great. I hope something happens. Every time, you know, Flat Earth is stupid and whatnot, but at the end of the day, you know what, I'm not gonna lie. I want Flat Earth to be real because that would be absolutely the most funnest thing ever. I want these things, okay? Uh, absolutely not gonna lie. I, I, I want these things. Flat Earth, the, uh, the Eclipse creating things. Because, by the way, I do think, uh, well... I wouldn't call necessarily horoscopes real, but I guess I'll finish next video. <clears throat> so boys, while I do not believe horoscopes to be, you know, exact or even anything close to that, I will say one thing. I do think definitely the position of the moon and stuff like that does affect people. I'll just, I'll just come right out and say it. I definitely think that affects people. Because think about it, you know, uh, moon moves a little bit erratically or, you know, something like that. What happens? Birds die. They, they lose their navigation and things like that. Well, that's the magnetic field. But also that's tied to the moon. And when you look at the statistics, even though in a, in a lot of cases it's bunk, the fact of the matter still actually persists. And the fact of the matter in this situation is very simple. The fact... That there are actually a lot of people who are born under a certain star sign that do uh, uh, share some 
traits that you would not expect. Uh, well, that they share more in common traits than others. Which I completely think could be a contributor to the, you know, moons and well, whatnots. Because I think all of that stuff has an effect on people. Now, how much? Hard to say. But I do think, honestly, it's a little bit more than just random pseudoscience non uh, nonsense, you know, at the same time. Or I could be wrong. That's absolutely fine also. Uh, not today, sweet dear summer child. <laughs> there we go. Protection is the best cure for all illnesses. Let's see if he does that again, by the way. Um, sure. What do I even do here? Do I just attack? Uh, let's see if he rats again. I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know if he's ratting again, boys. It, it could be a rat, it could not be a rat. Who honestly knows? He's getting damaged by the ring now, so that's 10 out of 10. Absolutely giga chat. Amazing. But he probably is gonna rat us again, which is not good for us. There we go. Since Falu. Wow, what, a, what, what an absolute giga chat. But I have it now, thank you very much though. Okay, we choose this and this. Beautiful, beautiful. And now, do I actually do anything? Four, six. Ah, why am I pretending that I'm actually, you know, doing any math or anything like that? It doesn't make sense. Anyway, let's start buffing up things. This is flying so that, you know... Uh, that thing doesn't matter. And he's taking damage. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. No, he does nothing. Is this gonna be a settled and wreckage play? Ooh, ooh, ooh la la. That is, that is very, very naughty if this is gonna be a settled and wreckage play. Oh, I'm gonna... I'm, I'm gonna take a little bit better position to sit. I am so tired, boys, again. Oh, my lord. All my body feels not great. This is why we're playing. This is why we're playing life gain again because I want to go easy on myself. I don't even know what fragment reality does, but it looks stupid. Well, it did something. Not gonna say it was all that impressive, but hey, it did something. I like how he just wants to draw with the ring. Ah, oh, man. Ring plus rats. Do you think he even has a win condition, by the way? I don't think he has a win condition. Union of the Third Pact. I could win. No, he's gonna replay the ring, I'm assuming. So we're not gonna win like that, which is problematic. Let's put this on purple. Oh. Oh no. Heliod. Heliod. Dude, what the fuck? What does this do? Exile target uh, enchantment opponent their player puts an oh random creature and I just got double soul wardens. Okay, okay wizards relax here uh, RNG Jesuses Yeah, double soul wardens. What a time to be a time Brat it loser Approach of the second son very approachy. I Mean it does make sense, you know, it does definitely make a little bit of sense. Okay, so we win anyway, I'm assuming. Actually, I don't know what to assume at this point. Bam! Uh, seven life. Is that gonna be enough? I don't think it's gonna be enough, actually. I mean, this is gonna be impressive. Well, wait, he can't actually draw with the bond ring. Wait, no. Did I just win? Because that's seven, right? Oh, boy. Unless... Oh, it's not a land, I say. Ooh, how unlucky! Nice, 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 nice. And there we go, a little bit of more of that sweet, sweet Razzmatazz, boys. Amazing. So I was reading the comments for last video, and by the way, I love it, it's hilarious. Ooh, if I get a soul, a soul lot in here, I instant. The comments for the last video were, by the way, completely hilarious, because turns out, the biggest segment of the video, I think it was the second game, had no audio. Yeah. When I render a video, I actually check at the start, are there any black bars, you know, any of that classical nonsense, uh, nonsense and crap. I, I didn't see them, but yeah. Happens very rarely. But I have to say, impressive blur, impressive blur, that something like that just happened and slipped in. Very cool, very cool indeed. 
Anyway, if I get helio and a soul bot, then we... Dude, what is this? What is this garbage dumpster fire on each one? What do you mean you're playing this? Oh, actually, wait a minute. I'm, I'm now... Uh, I'm now go doing the in-game sounds through the wrong channels. Here we go. This is... The, uh, amazing competitive YouTuber pr pr professional. Okay, boys, relax. Anyway, do I want to drop this or the a Valkyrie? Yeah, dropping a Heliod because he, he's the boy. And now what? If I get... Mm, how do I do this? Oh, damn, boy, stop! 11. That's not good. That's that's really bad. Uh-oh. What now happens if I look... Whoa, why are you with that? What, why you do that? Well, I guess that's fine. Very low chance that he just magically wins here. Psst. <laughs> that's funny. That's that that's funny. That's that's hilarious. Anyway. So what do I do? I do this. And then, then I can double block, I'm assuming, right? I do this. Collective company is pretty big, but I, I need the land, Wizardo. I need that land, a uh, land. If I drop the... No, 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 that's dumb. Okay, okay. I think I can survive. Boys, I am a survivor. Definitely Eye of the Tiger. Unless he drops more goblins that do more goblin things. In which case, big bad. Okay, well, here's the play. Uh, he shouldn't be too smart because, well, he's playing this garbage and, well, it's, it's garbage. So, uh, there we go. Surviving with 1 HP yet again, boys. What a giga chat. Actually, 3 HP. Woo, I did it. Yeah, yeah, so we did it. Okay. Keep keeping up with the Kardashians. Pretty good here, not gonna lie. Drop one more of these bad boys. And what now? Now this is seven life per turn on each one. Oh, -ho! how I win. Oh, delicious, beautiful. He Well, maybe he plays a Muxus and it's really bad. Ah, he plays a Muxus, shit. Okay, well, the Muxus has haste. And yeah, well, I guess, I guess, uh, I guess he's an idiot. His name is Blue. He's a card avatar. He's using this card back, and we have won a little bit too much. It is what it is, boys. You you can't always win because Wizards is a shittier company. Oh well, good game. You didn't. If I got the lands, I would have won. Not even close, boys. Not even close. Next time we're gonna get them. Oh, look at that. Now we get a soul warden. Ain't life grand. In any case, ooh, fancy. Well, we do have a helio and double soul warden, so our start is pretty... <coughs> oh, how that makes my head go zing, boys. How? Werewolves? Wait, why is this a joke? Oh, man, this is... This is... This is like a joke or something. He's playing werewolves. Well, they did ask me, did I have fun? And I said I did not. So wizards now need to uh, make up for their mistake. And, well, if we're playing against well, werewolves, this is definitely a amazing hand to make up the mistakes for. Uh, 10 out of 10. Oh, Man, that, that sneeze got my head spinning a little bit and hurting. The hell are you using this for, dude? Oh, well, I get it, it's cute, but it's not really that good, you know? Anyway, uh, what now? Uh, probably not much. What do I pump? A soul warden? Hmm. Choices, 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 as one might say. Anyway, drop the Heliod. Oh, that one sneeze, and I feel absolutely devastated. Man, that's, that's, that's not good, big, okay? Oof, man. Like the video, because I am taking these sufferings for you. Ooh, man. Oh, it's the fight thing. Ubu, Ava. Well, okay. Yep, definitely gonna sell Vard, and this doesn't matter too much. He, he gets it. Eh, why, well, who, who cares? Who cares, right? Oh, yeah. So, what now? 
why would you okay don't attack with it you you can't well technically you can but it's not gonna do anything because indestructible is a is a thing i guess oh yeah oh, just need to get through this boys man i'm playing the easiest deck in existence and i already can't physically manage myself this is kind of crazy i'm at my peak and it's how many minutes of video is this i'm gonna assume like Barely 10. <laughs> oh, oh man. Man. And you know what I did today? I took a nap, boys. That's right, I took a nap. But actually, the coolest part about getting the food poisoning was... Man. After I vomited, and it was a great projectile, you know? I was sitting on the toilet, I was gonna take a shit, and then I feel I feel water bulging up in my... Uh, my, my Amount and I'm like, oh no, evasive maneuvers. I'm gonna vomit, and I'm like, and the uh, the uh, and and you know it, it missed, and I needed to clean it up. It was bad. Don't like cleaning up vomit, obviously. But the good part is that, that you know at times like that when you're cleaning up vomit, it's like, oh wow, nothing really matters. Um, don't care if you attack me with that chief. You already lost. It is what it is. Oh, wow, a werewolf alpha pack leader thing. Wow. Wow. I don't care. So, yeah. And after I vomited, oh, man, I was sweaty, chilly, completely naked, obviously, because, you know, that's that's how you do it. And, man, it, wait, did I not block for the Heliod? Am I really that stupid? Don't answer. Oh yeah, I probably am, aren't I? Well, it's not like he can do anything here, honestly. <laughs> so, is good, boys, is good. Could have tried it to attack with that to get a little bit of extra pump, but I think this is fine. I think this is fine. Oh yeah. You got nothing, chief. Just, just surrender and relax. Just surrender and relax. Man. And after that, I went to sleep and it felt so good. The bed was so warm. Previously, it was chilly. I'm actually currently co feel completely chilled and not in the good way, you know? It, 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 is, it is terrible. But, you know, enough about my problems because no one gives a shit about my problems unless they're funny. We can talk about this guy's problems because <laughs> this guy's definitely funny. <laughs> ah, that's amazing. Anyway, what is he gonna do? This this soul button is getting pumped like there's no tomorrow. Ooh, ooh la la. That's nice, that's nice. Okay, so play this. Should I just buff up the resplendent angel now? I kind of feel like I maybe should. Ooh, that's not bad. It's actually usable for us. I like it. Well, maybe actually, no, I should probably go for the land because Collector Companies is literally the old Mega Giga Chad play here. So, we're gonna go for the Collective Companies. Oh, that's a land, that's big, boy. That's big. Woo, woo. Oh. Let's see what the Johnny Avatar does. Oh, look at that, he has the extra life. Oh, extra life is that charity thing. And they're doing a My Little Pony crossover. God, I wonder if Extra Life is one of those uh, shitty charities. Let's actually Google Extra Life Profit Split. Why did Extra Life make less money this year compared to uh, Extra Life? How does money go for Extra Life local member? Extra life community found the kids who should donate to go to local hospitals. But how much? Extra life donation percent. Let's see if extra life. Make a donation. Twitter. Why, why, why does Twitter suddenly get involved in this? Well, doesn't really matter. Yes, I still want that. Extra life mods. Wait, what the hell did this just happen? Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, Extra Life Guild Watch too, Wiki. What the hell? Extra Life Canada? Hmm. 
Well, I can't see any super negative articles instantaneously, so maybe Extra Life is good. Because again, keep in mind, most charities are fucking blatant scams, on almost honestly. So, you know, be, be a little bit careful about, about that, boys. Okay, we're still not winning, it seems like, which is preposterous, because we should be winning and killing and chilling. Um, what am I buffing? Probably this. Should I buff more things? Yeah, probably also, honestly. <laughs> I'm getting so many counters here, it's great. Well, this is what the life gain is honestly supposed to do, so, ooh. Uh, should I buff that? Probably not. Anyway. I'm gonna win next turn, and he surrenders. Nice. I think we're at the 20 minute mark, maybe, at the video. Which is big, ooh, yes, let's go, boys. Wow, combo wombo deck, eh? Okay, let's see how that goes. Let's see what he does. Whoa, what the hell was that? No, seriously, what the hell was that? That was like a Heliod thing here. Is that an animation I was missing all my life? Don't know. Land of War Elf, okay, okay, I, I, I feel you, buddy, I, I feel you, buddy. So let's do this. Aha, the Soul Bard in play. No one expects it, except everyone. Four mana available. I think this is Elves, right? This is just basic, oh yeah, it's fucking basic Elves, jeez. Oof. Oh, and a Saurus, okay, okay, that's really bad for us. Now, there is a small possibility, honestly. If we get Heliod. So, the reason why we need Solvard in Waifu is because we need to get that Voice of the Blessed uh, up, up, and ready. To just, you know, hi hit his face with a lifelink. That's, that's the plan. But currently, I'm not gonna lie, boys. The plan does not look like it's gonna happen. Our opponent is doing great things. Oh, look at that. Wait, that's not enough to actually win. I don't think so, at least. Well, that's a lot of stuff now that he has. Hmm. Well, at least that's flying. LOL. Let's see. Ah, oh, yeah, he's getting literally nothing. I like it. I like it. <laughs> okay, let's attack. So, he's gonna drop this. But wait, does he even have enough to attack me and kill me? I don't, I don't feel feel that. I completely don't feel like he has enough there, boys. Okay, that's for six. Oh no, he just used one elder shot and threw it. Maybe he does have enough, though. Maybe, just maybe, he has enough. How much damage is that? Uh, 28, 37, I think. Yeah, 37... 46 Yeah, that's that's a lot. Okay, I think we lost damn it Well one win away from ranking up, so I guess it's fine. Come on. Let's go boys. Yeah, we can do this We just need to oh that's burned. I can actually can probably win against that. Ooh Hmm Collective company and love light light game. I like it in any case it, whoa, play with fire. That's a weak start, my boy. As long as I get four lanes, I feel like I just, you know, win. Oh, wait, that's bad. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's kind of bad. Okay, let's do it like this. We're gonna have to take some damage. Oh, no, I could have dropped the Kaladic class. I'm such an idiot. We all knew that. We all knew that to a certain degree. And the good part is, it's not like he's actually gonna get too much done here from that. Everything he has is technically on an exile. So, nice, nice, nice. Do this, and what uh, what, what do now? I think I cleric class and now double this. Yeah, that seems like a good choice if I do say so myself. Okay, like almost nothing has happened. Nice. Okay, that's weak, that's weak. More more weak plays like this and we can do beautiful things together, I feel. A land, that's bad. Uh-oh. Oh, come on! He's just gonna exile everything? Oh, you little loser. 
Oh, come on. It's just it's just about going first. Hmm. Well, I can still easily win. Wait, what? Oh, he didn't do it? That's extremely dumb. That is without a doubt completely autistic. I like it. Okay, do this. If we survive next turn, we can do beautiful thing, but not surviving next turn. Collective company is my only chance to win. Oh, you know what? I'm I don't know what this is, but this loser is not running out of cards. This this guy's just uh, I mean, he's playing Arcanist, and this is kind of a forced win, and this is very, very, very visible. Turn one, play with fire, then Arcanist, yeah. I mean, there, there was no chance for anything. And he's not running out of uh, sauce or, you know, well, he's, he's just having an easy time. And I'm obviously not getting the lands. By the way, notice, we only lose when it's about getting lands. Yeah, wizards are just forcing us to lose with lands. It is what it is. By the way, this guy probably is running 18 lands, if anyone's wondering. So, uh, you know, suck on that. 